A bill for a possible filler solution for the shortage of child care educators was proposed yesterday at the Capitol to uh, Texas legislators. Providers say child care availability and affordability is in jeopardy without state investment. Talia Dobravo spoke with child care providers today and Talia, I understand this staff shortage impacts us right here at home. That's right. Executive Director of Child Care Partners, Carrie Goings, tells me that if this bill doesn't pass, 44% of child care provider services could close in the state of Texas. Child care provider educators are only paid $12 an hour with no benefits. Goins says that if the government doesn't continue to help fund providers, parents may not be able to work or afford care. She says industries will see desperate loss of workers, school district test scores will continue to be low, and an increase of neglectful supervision across the state. Across most of the U.S., um, most states put money towards early education and child care. Texas only puts enough money to draw down the federal government funds through the early education um, or the, the child care development block grant. They only do what they have to do. Um, we really need more investment from the state government to make this all sustainable. Goen says the child care relief fund is what's been sustaining child cares across the state, but is coming to a close with some centers down to their last paycheck. Now coming up on KTX 3 News at 6, we'll have more on the bill's impact. You'll also hear from executive director of the Texas Association for the Education of Young Children, who is still in Austin advocating for this bill. Okay, very helpful information. Talia, thank you very much. We'll see you at 6.